An early fourth down fumble, a mishandled snap on a punt. Auburn didn't do itself any favors last night in front of a hostile, overbearing Bayou Bengal Baton Rouge crowd. But in sports, we aren't afforded the luxury of what if. All we have is reality. So here's the reality. In the midst of a monsoon, Auburn outscored LSU 21-14 in the second half. Too bad the hole they dug early on was too big. Here's Simone Eli with more. Well, it was a Tiger battle here in Death Valley. The Auburn Tigers visiting the sixth-ranked LSU Tigers. First-year head coach Gus Melzahn coming off his first SEC win over Mississippi State last week and looking to make it two this week against LSU. But that would be no easy task in Tiger Stadium, especially with the weather conditions. A steady rain in Baton Rouge would not help Auburn off to a very positive start. First drive here, fourth and one. Nick Marshall going to fumble the handoff. LSU recovers quickly in the first quarter, which would lead to this. Mettenberger hands off to Jeremy Hill. A man among boys, 49 yards out, breaking tackles. LSU takes a quick 7-0 lead in the first quarter. Second Auburn drive now forced to punt, and the fumbled punt would lead to a 16-yard loss. LSU would have the ball on their own 10-yard line. And, of course, hand it off to Jeremy Hill. There he goes, his second touchdown of the evening. LSU leads 14 to nothing. Anytime you get in a hole against a good team on the road, uh, you know, it's tough enough anyway. And that put us in a hole, and we were fighting uphill, you know, the rest of the day. But the second half would be a little more positive for the Tigers. Nick Marshall going to hand the ball off to Trey Mason. He's going to take it 17 yards to the goal line. And the next play, Mason again. He would get in for Auburn's first score of the night. Gus Melzahn happy with his performance overall. You know, Trey's, Trey's a, a d definitely a good back. Uh, he's a tough guy. Uh, he wanted the football. And I think anytime you want the football, you know, that's, that's a good thing. And uh, overall had a solid night. Later, Mason would get in again. His second touchdown of the night, LSU would lead there 28-14. to And the Tigers just too strong at home. Later, Mettenberger going to complete this one to Javaris Landry. Downfield, 32 yards in for the touchdown. LSU would lead 35 14 there and go on to win the Tiger battle 35 to 21. So Auburn falls to three and one headed into week five, which is a bye week for the Tigers. Head coach Gus Melzahn says they have a lot to work on, but this loss also gives them a lot to build on. Reporting in Baton Rouge, I'm Simone Lai, Fox 10 Sports.